Hi there, once again, welcome back to my channel. Consider subscribing if today is your first time and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. In today's lesson, I'm going to show you how to manually introduce ad breaks on your YouTube videos. So in this case, first need to be at your YouTube studios. So when you open your YouTube studios, all you need to do is to click on the contents. So you see all your video listed and then just go ahead and then open the video you want to introduce the ad breaks on so in this case i want to introduce the ad breaks on how to automate exam score in excel so this is my video when you click on content you see the list of your entire videos and then i'm going to click on the pencil icon just click on that to open the details of the video So when you click on the pencil icon, it's going to take you to the details of that particular video. And in this case, you need to click on editor. Just click on that. When you click on that, it's going to give you option to do major changes to this video. So you can trim this video and remove some portion of this video. You can blur part of this video. You can change the audio, the end screen, the info cards and all that. The last option is the ad breaks. And in this case, you can see the timeline of this video. And what I need to do is that I want to introduce ad breaks. It's going to be manual. In this case, what you what is going to happen is that you can specify the time for ad to show on your video. So in this case, I'll just click on the plus icon. So the ad break, just click on the plus icon. Okay, so when you click on the plus icon, automatically it's going to start from zero zero. That means the ad is going to play before your video is even going to start. And what you need to note is that you can only introduce manual ad breaks when your video is eight minutes and above. Okay, so this video is just around 37 minutes, 34 seconds. So that means I can introduce as many as I want. But you don't, you don't need to add so much ad that will frustrate your viewers. So you can introduce an intervals of five or six thereabouts. So my first one is going to show before my video will start playing. Then click on add break and then you specify the time. Okay. So you can see the options where once I click on add break, it's going to give me option, the start time. And the next one after showing from zero to before the start of my video, the next one I want it to show around three minutes. So after my video play for three minutes, another ad will show. So I'm going to click on the zero. So it's going to be minutes, seconds, and frames. So the first part is minutes. So let me just change this to three. So this is going to be three minutes. So you can see this on your timeline. So at three minutes, another ad will show. And the next one, I want to introduce it around what? Seven. So seven minutes, I'll indicate another ad break. So in that order, just click on the ad break, and then you continue doing that. It's going to order them automatically. So this is going to start from zero zero and then to go depending on the time you specify. Remember to like and share this video and also don't forget to turn on the notification for videos that we change this one to around 15. So when it's 15 minutes, another ad is going to show on this video and then I'm going to speed up this video, fast forward this video and then the process is going to be the same. When we are done, I'll show you what to do. So I've actually introduced ad at least around five or so intervals because this video is very long some if i have a video around eight minutes i introduce around just three ad breaks when it's 10 minutes i introduce around four ad breaks and this is actually going to increase the rpm on that particular video so i've done that and like i said don't introduce too much ads which will frustrate your viewers so this is very long so i've introduced as intervals of five or so you can see from 20, 15 20 25, 30, 35, and in that order. So just introduce when you have more than eight minutes, you can use this method to introduce ad breaks on your videos and it's going to increase your RP and you can make some good revenue from your videos. So when you are done, you need to first go and then click on save. You need to save this for this to take effect. Other than that, it's not going to work. So I'll just click on save and this will apply to this particular video. And when people start watching this video, ads will not be shown at the duration the time which i specified for this particular video remember to like and share this video because i have a lot of techniques i'm going to show you i'll show you how to grow your youtube channel 
how to also improve on your revenue and how to get people to watch your video for long duration thank you so much for watching this short tutorial to like come your way again remember to like subscribe and also share this video bye bye